Hey, what's up? What's up, team? Sorry, I got to make this video. But uh, your boy wasn't doing too good. Out there trying to golf. Out there, out there golfing. And I'm out here in Texas, and it's extremely hot down here. I'm not used to it. And, um, man, I remember I was just out there, and I would, I would blink. And everything just be spinning everything was just starting to spin that was like after two hours into playing and like i'm like sweating like out of control and um i basically was like yo i gotta um i gotta go inside like cool down get some water or something and i went inside and then i just like i sat down and um I just started throwing up on the floor. And um and then I got on my knees and stuff trying to like find some type of comfort. Sorry, I'm shaking the camera. I'm like freezing cold right now. They're pumping a bunch of IV stuff in me. But um yeah, I just got on my knees and it was like, you need to call the ER. I was like, no, I'm all right. I feel better. I felt better because I wasn't standing up. I got down where it was cool at. They said I almost died, and it felt like it. Um, soon as they said my blood pressure was so low that I just wasn't getting a, enough, I don't know, blood, oxygen, whatever, to my brain that it, I start, you know, getting dizzy and wanting to pass out. So. Um, so anyways, I told the golf shop to call the ER. I was like, hey, I think y'all need to call the ER because I stood up to try to see if I was okay to go home. And when I stood up, it was game over. So I was like, hey, y'all need to call the ER. I mean, not the ER, but the ambulance. And uh, so they came, did all what they had to do, checked my blood pressure. And I started to drift off. I didn't know I was drifting off, but the lady, I heard the lady faintly in my ear saying, you still with us? You still with us? You still with us? And I was like, oh, snap. I was like, I was like, man, Jay, snap out of it. And I woke back up and she was like, oh, yeah, you got to go. You, they was like, yeah, you, you almost, you almost about to die. I was like, yeah, I was like, yeah, we got to go. I was like, so they, nah, I'm here. They pumping these uh, IV stuff in me. My arm covered up because it's real cold in here. But uh, yeah, sorry. Sorry about me having to make this video, man. But your boy got to do better out here, man. I'm, I'm, this heat is different. This heat is different and, and my body is just not like used to it. So I need to be. I need to take it easy. I need to recover. I'm, I feel like super weak. And whenever I stand up, I'm just like, just not there. So thank God, though, the, the guy that I was playing with, he was like, man, you need to go in there and get some water. So thank God that he told me to go in there. Because if not, I was just going to stay out there thinking that I was going to get through it. That's stupid, man. But yeah, your boy's still with it and I'm going to get better. So, y'all, just give me a few days to recover and um, pray for me. Um, I'm getting, I'm feeling a little better, but I'm just, like, cramping up severely right now. Yeah. All right. God bless y'all. And uh, keep studying and keep keep grinding, baby. I keep you updated. Just made it back from the, from the ER and uh, just want to give y'all this other update. I'm just I'm just recording this uh, little videos to keep y'all updated. You know, I stay in constant communication with y'all and I let y'all know what's going on because I appreciate all the love and support. I know y'all be praying for me. I end up getting discharged that night around 10 o'clock. What, what you thinking, boo? 10 o'clock? Mm -hmm. Around 10 o'clock at night, dizzy. I actually was able to... Uh, to, to walk out without, you know, getting light, too lightheaded. But I feel real weak. I felt like when I was breathing, I had to, at, at moments, I had to, like, do like that and uh, get some oxygen, something. But, uh, so, you know, my wife came and got me, brought me back home. 
my my stomach hurt. My stomach hurt a little bit. Like, like the cramps. The cramp, like my hands was trying to ball up on me like this. It was mainly this hand, my left hand. And you can see the muscles in here and the bone. I don't know if it was the bone, it was the muscles, right? It was probably the muscles. And you can see them popping out my hand. Like you can see them like getting like real like just tight and popping out. And I was like, I was trying to smash my hand straight to keep it from curling up. Cause I'm like, if it curl up, I might not be able to open it up. You know what I mean? So I'm like fighting against that. That was like when I was uh, talking to the ER people. But um, my hand feel weak. Anywhere that I had cramps, it hurts. It feels like the heck was that? <laughs> that was the dog. That's his. The that's heck? his pig. Hey, I did not. I did not pass gas. That was not me passing gas. Oh my god. <laughs> but um, that was the dog toy. Um, but anyways, uh, anywhere that I had severe cramps, it hurts. It feels like right now. Come here, Jax. Good boy. Anywhere, like it feels like I was, I've been doing crunches for like an hour with weights, and now they, you know the next day it hurts. That's what it feels like. And then my back, my shoulder blade, my neck, my hands, and my stomach. So, but anyways, I just want to keep y'all updated. I don't want to keep y'all long. I ain't trying to make no sad video. Pray for your boy. I'm as tough as they come. I'm as tough as they come. But. Um, you can't play around with this heat. This Arizona heat, Las Vegas heat, and this Texas heat. Ain't no joke if you ain't really been living here. So, I'm going to take it easy, y'all. Hopefully, I can feel better to make some more content next week. But I'm going to shut it down this week, y'all. I need to recover. I, I, I'm i feeling better as long as I lay down. But when I got to get up and move around or talk a lot, like right now, like I started to get like lightheaded. So, I'm going to go and call it a day. I love y'all. I appreciate all the support. Um, pray for me, man, and um, I'll see y'all next week. Peace.